Hey what's up guys do tech here welcome back with a brand new video in this video I have another beautiful and a new tweaks for you guys which is going to be compatible with a new iOS 10 jailbreak device I hope you guys enjoy today's video with that being said let's get it started Outlet. So when you download the tweak, it will be changed the whole set for your control center. So as you guys can see, the whole set right now on my control center is going to be different. So all the toggles right now will be in both sides. So if we go to the second page here, as you guys can see, this is the music part here. And then the other section of the iPhone will be here. To be honest, it's not that much beautiful. But if you want to download the tweak, it will be changed the whole main page of your control center. It will be set everything that looks like this on your iDevice. When you download the tweak, it has nothing to configure. It will be work right away on your iDevice. Atlas. The new theme for the Luck Glove, which is Mountain LG. Okay, let's talk about the Luck Glove X. There's a new theme it just got released. And as you guys can see, it's called Mountain LG. So when you download the theme, you will be go to the parents here, the second section. You just want it being to top on it. And then the theme will be right there on the top. So simply just click here. You will be see the theme that you downloaded, which is going to be called Mountain LG. Simply just tap on it and it is going to be work right away on your lock screen, just like so. Lock Glove X, new theme. Border Icon Plus. I have something that looks like a frame for every single icon on my iDevice, as you guys can see here. So this is the Border Icon Plus. So if we jump to the settings here, the first thing that you need to do is just enable the button here and then you can choose the frame color from there. So if you want to customize the color, simply just pick the color and then you have to just go back. Once you choose the color, you have to save changes. Once you tap on that, it will be pop up with a message saying you need to respring your device. After you pick the color that you want, to set it on every single icon on your iDevice you will be see all the icons will be take that effect and it's gonna be looks really beautiful when you set it on your iDevice this is the only thing that you have to configure once you download the tweak and it's really beautiful highly recommend you guys to download it because it's really nice on your home screen border icon plus Another cool tweak that I have for you guys in today's video, which is going to be the 3D color changer 10. So when you download the tweak, it will be change your 3D touch on your screen. So when you launch any one of the application, it will be right away, pick up the color of the icon set and then it will be pop up just like so. And then if we go to the tweak settings here, you have the first thing you need to enable the button here and then you can choose the auto detect app color and then you can enable the border here and then you can change the background of the color. So simply just stop here and then you can customize and pick the color that you want. The labels color, you can change that from there and then you can change other colors. Like for example, the border color, you can change that as well. Beautiful tweak and and it's nice looking for your iDevice and then you can find the tweak under the big boss here and then as I said you have to pay 0.99 for that tweak if you want to download it 3d color changer 10 pause so when you download the tweak it will give you a nice looking for your control center so let me just open the control center here and then as you guys can see the bonds here or the applications that I have on my control center which is the bottom one it looks different because I already changed that and then customize some icons using the polis tweak and I'm gonna be showing you guys how is that work so go into the settings of the tweak and then basically you need to go to configuration here and then you have two sections which is going to be the bottom shelf here and then the top you will be found the airplane mode and then the Wi-Fi, the Bluetooth and then the other stuff. You can play on, on those and then you can do some customize on those. So basically, if you want to change or customize some stuff, you want to add it on your control center. Basically, just go to the plus here, tap on it and then you can pick the app that you want to edit on your control center. So, for example, I'm going to be add my contacts here 
simply I'm going to be top on contact. I'm going to be press on done here. And then can you, you guys can see right now the contact I already added on my control center. The other thing, if you go back to choose one of the application and you want to add that to the bottom of your control center, you have to pay attention that it's ops here and it's toggles and in custom. So the toggles, you can change the toggles looks here and then you can pick the one or you can add the one that you want and then custom. So if you tap on custom, you can add a new one. So you can choose the custom button, which is you can go to select the icon. You can select the icon from here. It will give you a bunch and a lot of stuff. As you guys can see, it's a ton of stuff. So you can pick the icon that you want to add. For example, that star here, I'm going to be simply top on it. Get back here, the action, you can choose the action from here. And then you can simply just build that, go back here. And then you can pick the action, enable that action or dismiss CC on action. You can simply just enable that. And then you can simply, as you guys can see right now, I already customized some icon to put it on my control center and as i told you guys the toggles here you can change on some of the effects or looking icons on the toggles the ops here as well you can change some a lot of stuff using this tweak right there it's a really nice tweak giving you a lot of stuff you can customize a lot of stuff using that tweak customize your toggles a lot of things the bottom of your application as you guys can see here it's a ton of stuff that you can add and in the start that i made you can have control and pretty much in everything using this tweak to add a lot of stuff in your control center pulse i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you like the video please just like always give it a big thumbs up subscribe for my channel for more videos i see you guys in next video this is do tech Thanks for watching.